doing well. In today's video, I have a very fun unboxing, if you will, or unpackaging. And this is not sponsored or gifted or anything. It's a stationery brand that I discovered on TikTok one day a little while ago and I was stopped in my tracks at the most beautiful, gorgeous stationery I have seen to date and I just absolutely had to get as much as I could without seeming a little over the top and share my haul with you. So this is from a small business. I'll be sure to link them below in case you want to check them out. I'm excited to dive right in with you and look at all the fun stationery. I've covered the postage with some post-its. Well, considering I bought stationery, I think it's funny. I used my plain pink post-its. I am loving the purple packaging and the crinkles are divine. Trying to give you as much crinkles. I love that they chose this pinky purple color, which is honestly one of my favorite colors in the world. You're going to see a common theme of that. Because it just does very much represent their branding, and you'll see that soon. Thank you. Happy mail. Open. That's so cute. So this brand's name is Unicorn Eclipse, which is just the cutest name of all time. Happy mail. You're already seeing like a sneak peek of their style.
this is just the cutest ever. Unicorn Eclipse. I do want to preface that I did buy quite a bit. Um, but honestly, I just couldn't help myself. I honestly had to get rid of some things in my cart because I wanted everything. <laughs> but I figured I could always purchase again later, so I did have some kind of, res you know, held back a bit. That being said, I am so happy I got every single item that I'm going to show you. We hope you still, I think it says dream. Delicious crinkles. I love cute stationery so much, and it is very difficult to find in stores, so I was so happy to discover this business on TikTok and fulfill my wildest, um, dreamy stationery dreams. And I just feel very late to the bandwagon of cute stationery, so I have all of this to make up for that. like a tissue paper a little bit. That's so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's just dive right in, right? Okay. Yay. Oh my goodness. Everything looks so cute. Okay. Let me remove these items from the tissue. you so much for supporting our business. Feel free to tag us on social media and then, you know, contact us if you have any questions. It says, you are amazing. We hope you love everything. I think that's Chia and Alita. I'm not sure. Isn't this just beautiful? They have a very lovely illustration to style and design and I'm guessing these are the And it's just the cutest stationery. Even their little card. I just love it. So much. And then on the back here is another example of some of their designs. It's just kind of like playful, digital, cartoonish, but not. I don't I'm sure there's a name for it, but it's super cute. So. Okay. They have their kind of like little mini business card. Isn't that so cute? It's adorable. It's just so dreamy. clear. 
They do sell clear stickers, which run out of stock usually, so I gotta snag some more. colors and I just love like galaxy stuff. I mean, I have like a whole tattoo sort of dedicated to, I mean, all my tattoos are very celestial, so this is just super adorable. It's giving xenon, you know what I'm saying? So we have this like purpley blue post-it pad. Like it makes me excited to write things down. I want to use them. And then at the same time, I don't want to use them. <laughs> the struggle. It's got like a little planet in the corners and it's supposed to resemble like a digital window in a way. So that's just super cute. I love it. Then I got a pink one, which I mean there's two pink ones, but this one has clouds, and I will link all the products that I purchased, um, because I don't know the names off the top of my head, <laughs> but super adorable, it's got like little clouds, and little sparkles, isn't that just cute? It's just so dreamy, and I just love that a, such a beautiful design can be on a post-it that I can use. <laughs> it's just so cute. So, I love this one a lot. Super cute. Okay. And this final post-it is also pink and it's I think like the sister design to this post-it and you can tell they're just different color palettes for the most part. So this one's a beautiful pink. Gorgeous. Look at those little sparkles. I think if you're someone who appreciates stationery then this will definitely be a brand you like if you're into this kind of design and style and cute stationery. It's honestly the cutest stationery I've seen so far. Um, absolutely adorable. And I definitely got a lot of their space-oriented products, as you're going to see. But they do have like other styles that are great and I, you know, think fit other aesthetics people prefer, so I like that. But it's all kind of still in the same design style, if that makes sense. But yeah, I can't wait to write things down on these and I feel like they are just so cute. Like, can you imagine being at work and like just pulling out such a cute post-it? Like, I want to be that girl, you know what I'm saying? Or if you're in school, I remember in school I used to love my planner and I wasn't really big into like deep deep decoration of my planners but I think things like this were really up my alley and would have been really fun to have in college or high school even. So these are the post-its. We'll go 
ahead and move on to the next items. Next up we have some pads, notepads. This one is the same style as this post-it here. So it's just like the rosy clouds. Isn't this absolutely stunning? I am just so excited to have this. I've never really had such cute stationery, I think. Oh, I just noticed there's little roses. Sailor Moon aesthetic, in a way. Like the backgrounds of these types of shows that we love. So, this is not like a post it, it's just like a piece of paper, which I like. I don't think they sell large post it notepads, I could be wrong though. love having notepads around the house too simply because sometimes you just need to like write something down on a physical piece of paper um, I don't know that's just kind of like sometimes you need that and sometimes I'm like where do I have a notepad where can I find one and now I'm gonna have plenty <laughs> so this is so cute this one is equally as cute. It's a like grid and then has that kind of like digital framing. And it's like a purple cloudy design. These are two notepads that I got. The clouds. And then this like grid. I usually prefer blank or grid anyway. I've never really, I think lined paper was just something I had to use growing up, but for planners and like list making, I've always loved blank or grid. And I think because I just felt that I could do so much more structuring with that. Or maybe I was just jaded with lined paper growing up since that's all we used in school. So, these are adorable. And I like that they're small. I could tuck them in my day planner as well. I can stick them in my purse. I will definitely be taking some to work and I'm just going to be that girl with like super adorable, precious stationery at my desk. <laughs> stunning. Absolutely stunning. Creating like a little visual. Are we surprised? I got more notepads. They have a lot of cute notepads and I just couldn't not pick up at least these. There was at least maybe two or more that I wanted to also get, but I really had to pace myself. <laughs> so, 
over here we have this super cute notepad that has like this little loading bar which I think is so cute it has like that grid background and then it's cute because you have like different sections little pop-up windows and I love this because I can sort of like do different groups of lists which I love and so I and I also love that there wasn't anything pre-written although they do have some of those options so you can get something like that like it says goals or like to do something like that but I liked that these were blank so I could be creative with my ideas of how to use them and I love it so cute just so precious and beautiful and I think so many people from so many ages would love and they're pretty reasonably priced um, I mean it depends on what you prefer to pay stationery for so um, we have next the purpley kind of like cyber town with the little ferris wheel and it's just so cute and like nighttime a couple other items in these different like designs so if she has like or they have like a design um, and then they create like sticky note versions the notepad they have other like stickers and stationary items in the same design so I definitely liked this design in the notepad so I want you can have like a matching set of items in the same design if you wanted. So, do another up close. These are little stars. Oh, there's a little heart. That's so cute. a lot honestly I don't really use stationery up too frequently so I know this is gonna last me a long time mainly because I might not want to use it all the time but um, especially because I got so much like honestly this is a lot but I could not help myself like I said the designs were just so pretty and I needed to And I will make great use of them, absolutely. And I love that, you know, like it's a small business and I feel like I want to get more because I appreciate the work that they do and the care for their designs and their items and their creativity. So like for me, it's even like a collection, which I know so many people have like sticker collections such so sometimes it's not about like trying to use up the item but like more about the appreciation of it which is definitely prevalent in uh, this hall <laughs> so okay All right. so next up we have a like larger notepad this one has the, um, I think it's a weekly planner notepad actually, and it has the days of the week. So it actually has Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then it combines the weekend, which I think is clever because often that you end up doing that anyway. Um, and then you have like priorities, thankful for, and notepad. So, it's again like a nice little city. This 
sign says you got this <laughs> got like a moon and stars clearly this is the design style I went for I feel like having all of this allows me to have more things to play with on ASMR videos, you know? It just kind of will foster more creativity in those videos, hopefully. Whatever videos I end up using these in, if at all, but yeah. I actually got my delivery today. Um, when I was planning what video to film, I got the delivery notice and I was like, I need to film this. This unboxing of the Unicorn Eclipse stationery. Because I have been waiting. Not that it was a long wait, but I felt like it was. <laughs> so, I'm so glad that it came in today. The stars align. I'm excited to use this. I'll probably use it at work or at home. I don't know. We shall see, but I do love a good like weekly planner notepad. I think it's super useful. some fun little items. Okay. So I got some stickers. I'm not a huge sticker person, so I only got a couple for now. Um, this one actually here, I didn't order. I think they just gave it, you know, as like a free sticker gift. Isn't that just the cutest little thing? I am obsessed. It's a little slice of cake and it looks like lavender. I'm so thankful they gave me a little free sticker. I did purchase this sticker sheet. And it is, I think it's just one. Yeah, it's just one. Um, and I mean, this is just absolutely beautiful. Like, this isn't something I can find at Target, you know? I, I'm not even sure I can find this at, like, Office Depot or Staples. Um, I know there's like a whole planner community out there that's like probably in their head right now being like, um, we know there's cute stickers out there. Where have you been? <laughs> um, I have not been aware, that's for sure. So these are super cute because they're like little boxes and I thought I could like write little notes. You know, like maybe I have an appointment or something fun is happening that day. And I like that there's different sizes. Like a long one, small one. It's like medium sized ones too. And they're just so adorable, honestly. Obsessed. Obsessed. Well, just with everything. So this sticker, I believe, is clear, and I wish I could buy like a whole pack of them. You know how there's like clear post-its? I don't know if they do that. I 
think it's just like a clear sticker. So I'm, I only got one and now I just don't even know if I'm ever going to use that. <laughs> I wish I was into scrapbooking, but I'm just like not, I mean, I just don't really have, I guess like the motivation to do that. But if you're a scrapbooking person or you like scrapbooking ASMR stuff and that kind of is like a fun hobby, these would be such a cute um, addition to that, I think. And I will find a use for this for sure, but it's got like a moon and some planets and so it is a sticker and I believe it looks clear. Um, so. I'm excited to test this out someday. We'll see. This just makes me so happy having these types of things. And it's just, I don't know, it gives me so much joy. And I'm sure it also gives some of you joy too, seeing like and appreciating stuff like this. If you also like to collect things like tend to like to collect notebooks <laughs> that I love that are cute and I think that goes for stationery as well. Okay. So there are the final items I received or purchased and they are bookmarks which I definitely needed an upgrade of bookmarks. I feel like when I'm reading a book, I just grab whatever I can find and it's always like a random receipt or something. It's just so not cute. You know what I'm saying? So, I decided to purchase some bookmarks and be cute and girly and fun while I'm reading and they are honestly motivating me to start putting them in all my books. So, this first one here is like a really cute music player. Kind of like a Spotify player. I love that. And it's a nice dreamy pink aesthetic. And they have this design in like post-its and notepads and stuff like that too. Oh, it's the same design on the back. Oh, that's so cute. I like that they do that. That way, like, no matter which way you see it, it's the same design. I would say it's firm. It's not, like, indestructible, though, so definitely be careful in handling. This one is just such a cute design. It's like a traffic stoplight and it's adorable. Like how does someone even concept this? Like the, this is water and like a heart and star and moon. Like I never would have thought to put like a water element in there. I love it. It's very fantastic very unicorn, one might say. And it's the same on the back. Next, we have this gorgeous design as well. It's a Twilight, pinky, moon, rising sort of feel <laughs> with the clouds. Need to, it's like the sunset, but then like the moon is out at the same time kind of vibe. I just love that I have cute bookmarks now. Like, I don't have to look at, you know, I don't have like a random Walmart receipt sticking in my one is cute because it's a library and they have little books and a little window so I like 
liked that because it's very like reader oriented. Adorable. I love the library. It's my favorite. Yeah, it's so cute. So delightful. I loved everything I got and it was absolutely worth every penny for me. But of course, you know, if you are purchasing from them, there are so many options and designs to choose from. I mean, it might be a little difficult to be honest. They have a lot more stickers. I don't, I didn't get like a ton of stickers again because I wasn't sure I would be using them very much. But I might purchase from them again in the future and try to get their other designs. And they come out with new products, I'm sure. So definitely keep an eye out for them over the, you know, what is it, like August, September time when new stationery tends to come out too because of school, they might come out with new stuff then too, but they have a TikTok and everything. Um, they are at, I want to see this, we'll focus. So they are at Unicorn Eclipse on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. Oh, didn't even know they had a YouTube, but I saw them on TikTok, so go ahead and follow them, check them out. Well, I hope this was a fun little video for you and that all of this gorgeous stationery was fun and relaxing. I was very excited. and loving everything, for sure. I love paper sounds and stationary sounds as well, so it was fun to play around with all the paper sounds. Yeah. I'm just so in love and thank you so much for unboxing this with me. I appreciate you watching and I hope you enjoyed. And again, I'll try and link everything I got below and of course the main website. Okay. All right. Well, I think I'll leave it there and I hope wherever you are, you're doing well, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.